For many businesses, Google's G Suite and Microsoft's Office 365 have become essential tools for effectively scaling workflow. But with so much resting on these applications, the safety of the data stored on these services is of the utmost importance. BoxSafe is an application for the QNAP NAS designed for you to safeguard your business from potential data loss from these services. In this tutorial, we'll be going over how to back up your Google G Suite. To start, you'll need to install the BoxSafe app in the App Center. Once you've installed BoxSafe, open the app. Click the Add Domain button and select whether you want to back up a G Suite account or an Office account. In this tutorial, we're backing up a G Suite account, so I'll select G Suite. Now input the domain for the service that you would like backed up, along with the G Suite admin's email address and the service key, and click Authorize. If the time on your NAS is not accurate, you may get an error requiring you to adjust the NAS time in the time settings of the control panel in order to proceed. Now you will see your domain info, including your domain name, admin name, admin email, and domain services. All of your domain services will have the checkboxes checked by default, indicating that each of those services will be backed up. However, if you only wish to back up certain services, you can check and uncheck boxes simply by clicking the checkbox. For this tutorial, I will leave all boxes checked in order to back up all services. Make your selections and click Next. On this page, you will set the backup schedule. You can choose to set a backup schedule for all applications or you can create backup schedules for each individual application. For this tutorial, I will create a backup policy for all applications. In creating the backup policy, you'll choose between a one-time backup, manual backups, and auto backups. Next, select backup time or frequency. I'm going to opt to create an auto backup that backs up once a day. You can check a box to delete older backup versions after a set period of time in order to maintain storage space for future backups. You may also choose to end the backup schedule after a set date by leaving the box checked and selecting a date. For this tutorial, I will let the backup job continue. Make your selections and click Next. The final page of setup is the Add Users page. This is where you choose the G Suite users that you want to back up by checking or unchecking the appropriate boxes. Make your selections and click Add. You will now see your BoxSafe dashboard with your BoxSafe protection status is fully protected. This does not necessarily mean that the data from G Suite has already been backed up, as you can see that it hasn't been backed up yet. But it does mean that there's a backup policy in place. Under Domains, you can see all the service domains that you are connected to. Under Settings, you can add and manage BoxSafe users. And if you look in Tasks, you'll see the tasks that are currently running under Running Tasks. And you can check events in the Logs section. None of my scheduled backups have actually taken place yet. So in order to show you how I can view all of the user's data, I'll run a manual backup by going to the dashboard clicking the domain, selecting the users, and then clicking backup now. Once you have some items backed up, you can view them by going to the domains tab and clicking somewhere on the row of the domain that you would like to view. You can search users here, and additionally you can select between different categories of backups such as emails or contacts. Within the various categories, you can run searches specifically for that category. Also, you'll be able to select which user's backup you want to search within a category by using the drop-down menu. BoxSafe helps you to utilize your QNAP NAS as a backup destination for G Suite and Windows Office 365. Be sure to check out the rest of our videos to better utilize your QNAP NAS.